So hey guys, it's me Yuki. How's life? Uh, I hope everyone is doing great. And anyway, welcome to my channel, which is also my first video. Um, as mentioned, I'll be taking videos of me um, reacting towards university decisions. And I've applied to six Canadian universities, and I'm applying as international students. So the reason why I only applied to one country was because I wanted to stay focused um, in one location. So I do not need to decide where to go later on. And honestly, I'm not quite sure what to major in yet. So I've applied to humanities program, social sciences program, international economics, and businesses. And also, I wanted to say that please do not stress yourself out too much when you're applying or to students who are planning to apply soon. I would suggest searching up your ideal university first and get familiar with their requirements and also keep track with their timetable, such as when should you start applying and when should you upload your grades or what are the supplements that you need. So you'll get prepared and everything is good to go. Okay, I should stop talking and let's get into my videos. So, hey guys, today is December the 14th and I just received an email update from University of Calgary. Yeah, it's so early and I'm nervous because it's too early. Okay, so I'm logging into the portal now. Oh my god. <sighs> Yay, I got in finally. Yes. One in. Okay, so the offer says, "Congratulations on your offer of admission, and it is my great pleasure to congratulate you and your offer of admissions to the University of Calgary and welcome you to the Faculty of Arts." Yay. So hey guys, I just received an email from University of Ottawa saying that they've updated their decision. So I'll have to log into my uh, student center to check out the result. Yeah. Okay, I'm so nervous. Okay, let's do it. Yes, 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 I got accepted. Yes, 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 yay, yay, I got accepted. So guys, the thing is that today is school day and I just finished my breakfast. And while I'm having my breakfast, I checked my email and I saw an update from MacMaster. It says something MacAdmit, but I didn't click in it yet. So I just ran up to my room and opened my laptop. And yeah, let's check. Oh my god. Okay, I'm so nervous. But I don't know. It says Mac admit, right? Right? Okay. Okay, okay, I found it. So the 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 email says MacMaster University offer congratulations. And it's from Mac Admit. Yeah, it's from Mac Admit. Yay! I got a, I got an offer. Yay! Okay, I'm running out of time. I need to go to school now. Bye. So hey guys, a notification just popped up, and it's from UPC. I have no hope for this. Like literally, like oh my god, because I think I messed up my application form. Yeah. So UBC's application form is a bit unique. There's a bunch of questions for you to answer with word limits. And uh, as I remember, I wrote a bunch of paragraphs. Yeah. So it was actually challenging. So after completing the question part, you'll need to do a interview, online interview. Yeah. So there will be questions and you will need to answer it 
within the time so they set the time for us and you need to answer them according to the time yeah <laughs> yeah i'm so sad about it like thinking about my application form but anyway let's check <sighs> see how it goes oh my god yeah. Oh, I didn't get in, I didn't get in. Anyway, it's alright. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> okay, so the application says, uh, wait. Thank you for your application for admission to the University of British Columbia. Unfortunately, we are unable to offer you admission to UBC. Our decision is based on a broad-based review of all documents, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So, oh, okay, so one interesting thing uh, that happened is that um, before I started ap applying to all universities, my school have a university fair and UBC also attended, so I just went to the presentation and got this little sticker look how cute so anyway next bye so guys today is april the 16th and i just checked my email and got two updated emails from carleton and mcgill which is my last two university decisions so yeah i'll be checking them now but of course, I'm gonna go with Carleton first. <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. Ugh, okay. So their email says Carleton admission decision notification. An admission decision has been made on your application to undergraduate. Oh, okay, I need to log in. I got in yes yes okay one more to go <laughs> ah, I got in oh my god Jeez. nah I don't want to check my girl <sighs> okay I should do it anyway yeah Okay, so here we go, McGill. It says, Admissions Office, McGill University. Oh, it's a rejection. Right? Okay, so it says, I am sorry to be sending you some disappointing news regarding your fall 2020 application to McGill University. We are an we are unable to grant you admission at its time to the program or program list below. Well, sad. Yeah, it says, McGill receives a very large number of blah, blah, blah. And I applied for B-commerce for McGill. Anyway! Let's move on. So, hey guys, as you know, that I received all six university decisions and I got into four and got rejected from two universities. Yeah, I'm alright, it's okay. Uh, I also wanted to say that, especially to students out there who are also receiving their results and checking their decisions, you're more than just an offer, you're more than just a decision. So, please, please do not feel too depressed or too sad about it. 
and I guess it's the end of the video please feel free to comment down below or shoot me a DM in Instagram and like and subscribe thanks